Hey, what's up everybody? This is Jason with DevSlips.com, and in this video, we're gonna learn how to install Nginx onto our server. Now right now, if I try to access this IP address in the browser, I'm not gonna be able to fully connect to the server. Even though our droplet says that this thing is live and it's active, which it is, there's a small setup process that we need to finish in order to connect the dots here. So just to show you, I'm gonna copy the IP address, paste this up into the browser, and the site can't be reached. Now, let me show you what Nginx is. So if you go into the dashboard, and then I want you to come down to tutorials right here. We're just gonna type in install Nginx. And we're gonna choose the this one right here, install Nginx on Ubuntu 18.04. All right. So, it says Nginx is one of the most popular web servers in the world and is responsible for hosting some of the largest and highest trafficked sites on the internet. It is more resource friendly than Apache and in most cases and can be used as a web server and reverse proxy. All right, so we're gonna just go ahead and install this directly onto our server and go ahead and pull open your terminal. All right, we're gonna do some copy pasting here. Let me zoom up on this, just to make sure we can see everything here. So the first thing we wanna do is this apt update, okay? Now, I'm not doing the sudo command because I'm already accessing the server as root, which is like the admin. So I don't need to use sudo. So we're gonna do apt update. It's gonna install a bunch of stuff. And then we're going to do this command here. Cool, and go ahead and paste that one in. Now we're gonna actually install Nginx. And yes, we want to continue. It's just telling us how much space it's gonna take up. Our droplet has X amount of space on it, right? Um, it's just telling us how much space it's gonna take up on our server. And next, we're going to do some adjusting for the firewall. So if I was to throw this command into the terminal, it's going to output this. I'll just do it for fun. Let me type out clear. All right, so you can see that we have these available applications and the one we're gonna work with is this one right here. Okay. So we want to allow this. So I'm going to copy this allow nginx HTTP. Okay, hit enter. And the rule was added. Okay, cool. So we can verify our changes by checking the status. So UFW status. And you can see that it's right here. So we are allowing this. We added this rule into here. Okay. And then, yeah, it shows that it's active and everything. We saw that. Cool, so now that we've done this, um, let's just check that the system and service is running. And we can do that by typing in systemctl status nginx. Cool, so now you can see that everything's running. So guess what that means? If I come back to the browser and I refresh on this tab, now that we have nginx installed, we should see something. And there it is, welcome to Nginx. So that is great news. We've officially set up our server and we are now ready to get our project uploaded to this thing. So let's do it. 